My name is David Kay and I work for People's Voice Media. Uh, well, just today I was working at Victoria House. That's um, a place for people who have been homeless, who are sort of, you know, getting their lives back on track. And there we've begun a community reporters program for quite a few years now. And um, it was very much tailored to what they want to do around the themes. And they're looking at things like video and a little bit of audio. And really, it's about just supporting people telling stories in their way. Um, other groups, again, sort of early this week was over in Dewsbury. And there, again, was just working with a group of local residents from Dewsbury who, again, have different stories to tell. Well, it is very much really about giving people skills, which hopefully will, hopefully will be useful in, you know, the real life. But it's not so much just general social skills as such, although that's part of it. It's more saying, you know, there's the whole issue of, you know, giving people the power to be able to tell their stories and, you know, really just communicate in their way. So it builds on from what I've done in the past. So in the past, I've worked with a youth service around producing um, a community newsletter. Same work for Old Trafford News, producing a community newspaper, been involved in community radio, all these different things. And it's really ways of getting, supporting people and getting their message across. And obviously, they will learn and develop skills as part of that. But I think often it's not in that structured learning way it's actually you know and I think the key thing is actually creating something so rather than just seeing it about learning it's actually you know has real outcomes and outputs I don't know it's, it's always good to to learn it's about you know developing uh, you know being flexible and and sort of you know find out what people want to learn and then supporting them in learning that so i guess that's my sort of idea of you know being you know hopefully having a syllabus that's flexible enough to be to be able to respond to people's needs rather than just saying you've got to learn x y and z I had you know a qualification in community work ended up in various different jobs which weren't really related to community work and then decided that the way to get into community work was probably more through sort of teaching. So the key bit for me is the community, the community aspect of it rather than the, the teaching aspect of it. So I got a teaching, a, sec a PGC secondary qualification, and that then led me into doing lots of things which I wouldn't have done, which, you know, and things like isn't traditional teaching, but is more supporting people, young people with disabilities, developing independent living skills. And then that was what led to working for the youth service as well as doing bits of teaching. And because of that, it sort of got me in a slightly roundabout way back into what I want to do, which is more about the whole community development bit.